quick video here on the mongoose cable and newer Range Rovers. Uh, I had a buddy call me up to use this for the first time. He was resetting his BMS or installing a new BMS and a uh, new battery. So he wanted to tell the car to reset. Uh, and it wigged his car out, 2016 Range Rover Sport. So as soon as he plugged this thing, the dashboard would light up, the radio would light up. It would do all sorts of weird stuff even with the thing disconnected from the uh, computer. So, uh, doing some research, pin 13 down here, I just want to, this, you know, you, you count. Pin 13, it's right there. That's for airbag uh, communications and diag on newer Range Rovers. Mine doesn't have it, mine's a 2013, but the US market Range Rovers have it. So, if your uh, mongoose cable is giving your newer Range Rover a problem, snap pin 13 off. Count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Blah, blah, blah. Snap pin 13 off. And watch your ghost codes, your, especially if it says like CAN bus, high, low, you know, error, can't communicate, modules offline snap pin 13 off all right you'll save yourself a world of hurt and on newer range rovers especially i think this is like maybe north american market only um but if you have a uh wire in pin 13 on your obd2 connector inside your range rover or range rover sport um that's what's messing it up so all right guys there's a little tip of the day for this thing. Enjoy it.